Charles IV, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles' son, Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor, which did little to endear him to the Pope. Wenceslas the Idol did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate, then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's allies. It is here that my story begins. How are you doing, everybody? Oh, Thank you all for coming back to the live stream. Hope you've had a good rest after all you've been through. You might need it. We've got work to do tonight, so get up and get going to Tallenberg as soon as possible. You need to rouse Sir Divish and his men for the attack. We'll meet this evening at the Stronghold and settle up with that sly bastard. Sir, I lost all my things at Flanagan. I need to get my stuff back. Like, my stuff. Yes. I can't believe in that there. Here's the key to the armory. Take whatever you need. You deserve it. Right, it's up there. I need Listen to set up, up as soon as possible to give the right town workers a message. Or they won't arrive in time to help us at Vranjik. Better not be rubbish stuff. I top tier stuff, man. Get up, you lazy bastard. Oh, that's where you, uh, Joffrey. So it's no in here. Wake up, you little bastard. Well, Henry, it cost me a lot of effort, but it seems I've finally succeeded in making a half decent warrior out of you. Anything I can do for you? Take care.
What the hell was that? Aye, it is in here. I thought that. I was wondering why it wasn't like me in there. This is all rubbish stuff, man, compared to my stuff. What is going on here? Oh, terrible, man. I need to go back and get my stuff. There's a mace. Still no better than my mace, though, right enough. Oh, what about that one up there? Right, I need armor though, man. What? What's going on? Really? Is that it? Rubbish stuff compared to my stuff, man. I'm gutted. Gutted. Right, I found out what I was needing to do. Look at the horse. There it is. Right, I remember all my money. I've not got... Oh my god, no way. Right, no, I need to start this again. I need to start this from all the way back there. I cannot do that, it's just not... So angry at myself right now. I'm gonna need to go back, everybody. I cannot believe I need to do this, man. But I need, to, like, as I must. It's my mic on, everybody. Let somebody let me know in chat. I'd appreciate it. No, I better take a look around here. No, let's leave. Leave, Henry. That's it. Don't want to be here just yet. Eh? Let me out. Right, I'll find... I know a way out anyway. I was in here before. I'll get out again. Not only it was up outing, over this wall. Ones too. This isn't good news. It was up and over here, I'm sure. Last time I did this, it was at night as well, so I could hardly see. It wasn't that one. No. Where is it? Was it this one? I didn't want to talk to you, mate. Fuck off. Oh, come on, I can't make it out of here. I need out. Just let me out. Come on, Henry. Surely you can jump over that, lad.
Right, I think we might need to go back again. Wait, wait. Nah, you're not getting over that, Henry. Right, aye, we're gonna need to go back further. It's got to be this one. I just don't know how far back it's put me though. Hey, how far back did this put me, man? Let's check the missions out, see how far. Right, we're not that far to be fair. He must be trying to come through, yep. Hey. You're a dickhead. Right, have I got my money? Let me check. Yep. Right, let's go and do this quickly. Right, this was why I wanted to save up my money, and you really do need to, but I didn't know it was DLC, so let's go. Right, uh, is it that there? Hold up, it must be. Yeah, must be that. Come on, hurry up. Whereas he must be outside again, or in the kitchen. No, where is he? There he is. Greetings. What business have you? Can I be of service to you, Sir Davis? I've heard talk that something is going on in Pribis Lovitz. Henry, you've come at just the right moment. I sent a man to Pribis Lovitz, my locator, Marius. What's a locator? A land allocator. I charged him with checking on the condition of the settlement to see if we can start rebuilding it. Why Pribislavitz of all places? Because it's been lying fallow and falling into ruin since it was sacked by Havel Medic years ago. It's about time that changed. You're planning to resettle the village? Yes. Well, it should be safe there now. We trounced that rabble on the battlefield. 
Yes, and that's why I sent my master locator there. However, he should have been back long since. If you've no objection, I could go and look for him. I'd appreciate that. He probably just got delayed. But I'd be happier if you checked it out. God save, my lord. I hope things are peaceful in your fiefdom. Peace? Peace is rare in these times. But right now I'm more troubled by politics than warfare. What's wrong? The monastery stalled the purchase of stone and everything connected to the building project. <laughs> and now I find out it's because of the quality of the stone blocks, or so they say. I don't believe a word of it. It looks like profiteering to me. What do they say is wrong with the stone? I was going to do the Witcher Supposedly tonight, there was but I knew we were quite close to finishing this game. So I just want to try and get this finished the swears and then move on to the next game. Impossible. He says he sends only the best stone, and I believe him. He's reliable and an experienced quarryman. Profiteering? What's the monastery trying to accomplish? To lower the price. What else? We've already given them a fair price, and they still delay with payment. Or worse. Worse? You mean they'll stop paying completely? You could put it that way. They're looking for an excuse to back out of the contract, and find another quarry where they'll be able to secure a more favorable deal. And is anyone dealing with the problem? Well, my chamberlain is in charge of it. As always. But all he's done is send them a letter. He says putting more pressure on the monastery could provoke them. Those are his words. So there's nothing else that can be done? I don't know. I've been thinking about taking a more direct approach. But I expect the Chamberlain won't even hear of it. He'll just keep on sending them polite letters and hoping that does the trick. I could help with this. Do you think this is a job for you? You aren't even in my service. I do serve Sir Radzig. He knows he can rely on me when he needs me. I've never let him down. This is true. So do you want to go to Sassol and ask about the stone? Yes, I'll do it. Good. I'd like you to ask about the stone and keep your ears open. See if they aren't talking about another quarry. I'll do my best. Hopefully they'll talk to me. They will. You ride in my name. So don't forget to remind them of it. Take care now. This is a good part of the game. Like, see this DLC. I didn't actually know it was DLC. I thought it was uh, a part of the main story, but... I had a little Google. I Googled it a wee bit. Just because I knew we were, we were near the end of the game, so... Right, anyway, shut up and just move on. Definitely one of the best missions in this game though. Or the best, one of the best things you can do in the game I should say. I should have just cut, I've just went right, done like a big circle around there. To the monastery. Oh, yeah. Right, I'll go and do that first. When I go into that 
other part of the mission, but I did go into the bandit camp. I'm going to take all my armour off, actually. Right, it must, in fact, he is up here. I remember where he is. Dog, out my way. He's up here. There he is. You better not be hunting my fucking dog. Who else is there? You get one So I sleep, you prick. You better not be hunting my dog. Still with us. You too. Where was the other wee guy? Where was the other guy team? Yeah. Oh, it's not let me jump. Right, move all that stuff to the horse. Right, can I carry any more? In fact, that, where's that? I'll take that, in fact. It's better than mines. Right, moving on. Could do with a bite to eat. Right, what tent are you in again, mate? Is it this one up here? No. There he is. Thank you. My pleasure. Sir Divish sent me to find you. And it looks like I arrived just in time. God's truth. I'm Henry of Scalith. My name is Marius Bielek, Master Locator. Sir Divish sent me here to survey the area. Well, the outlaws are out of the way, so we can go and report to him, right? Not just yet. Those bastards caught me as soon as I arrived. And so far, all I've seen is the inside of the tent they tied me up in. I still have a job to do. Come along with me, if you like. We'll report to Sir Divish afterwards. I'll escort you, then. At least I can make sure you don't get caught again. What? Are there more of those bandits around? No, no. I nah, just took care of them all. Never mind. Should we get going? Hey, got another wee bite to eat. This is a good spot for the rat house. Every village must have one. It'd be nice and prominent here. It's on the hillside, so the foundations will stay dry. It can have its own little square, close to the church. There's no better site here.
you you rebuild all this place. That's why I've always said to people if they buy the royal edition to save as much money as you can in this game. It did a good job. Considering how old it is and what it's been through recently, it stood up well. It won't be an easy job to fix it, but it can be done. Timber alone won't do though. Where are you going, mate? at least one tradesman's shop here maybe a baker's where are you going you mad man Quite a lot of space here. It just needs clearing thoroughly. Then we could even fit stables here. Approach road and stream. <clears throat> this bridge needs reinforcing. It won't last long in this condition. I reckon it would make sense to build a weir over the stream down there. The water here is clean. It can be used to supply the village until we sink a well. Does that look clean to you? We have this stream. No point in building without a water source. Supplies and trade will flow through here. can't even see past the trees and ruins whether there's room for anything there but at least the trees are strong and healthy all we need is a few good woodcutters and we won't have to bring in any timber from elsewhere we just need some stone mate I've got the money we're gonna hear this place booming in no time Stone foundations. They'll come in handy and we're close to the stream. What way are you going?
There's a well here already. All the better. Yeah, it's like it's done then, mate. A big space, clean water, close to the village green. A good site for an inn. that then the most essential surveying is done hmm right so let's build the place in so master locator ready to start building there's a long way to go before that the few ruins that are left are basically beyond repair it's all overgrown with brush oh dear we we'll have to get it all cleared before we can start rebuilding it. So it is possible to rebuild everything? Yes, absolutely. But building a whole village is no small enterprise. Hmm. We'll need timber, lots of it. Which isn't a problem in the middle of the woods, of course. We'll have to hire wage labor to begin with. Quite a lot of men. Hmm. Hmm. I think we should get started without delay. There's a lot of work involved. But it'll be well worth the effort. I can just imagine it. The church will dominate the whole settlement. Oh, that's good news. When will you inform Sir Divis? Why wait? I'll head to Townburg right away. But would you keep an eye on things here in the meantime? It would be rather embarrassing to run into more bandits when I return with Sir Divis. No problem. I'll be right here. It shouldn't take us long. My lord, welcome to Pribislavitz. That is to say, welcome back to Pribislavitz after all these years. Well, what's left of it? Not to worry, Marius. <sighs> I'm glad to be back in my old hamlet. Although, it seems to have aged about as gracefully as I have over the years. I beg to differ, sir. It's quite dilapidated, unlike your good self. But at least it's safe now. Thanks in part to Henry here, who also saved me from a predicament that cost me valuable time. Who knows? If it hadn't been for him, we might not even be talking now. Well, lad, in the end, you managed things in your own way, I see. Just as you said you would. I did my best, sir. I won't bother you with the details, sir. You have more important matters to attend to. Let's get down to the matter in hand, shall we? What state is Pribislavitz in? Sir, in my official capacity as locator, I am gratified to inform you that the hamlet of Pribislavitz may be renewed. And indeed it offers prospects of considerable expansion beyond its former limits. Splendid! Finally some good news for this province. And badly needed, too. So, what have you discovered so far? I want to know all the details. Uh, there's a stream here, and a well, right in the middle of the village. Yes, and there are abundant woods around. Clearing them will provide both extra land Surely he would know that, because right this was his town now, anyway, so... On the village green, aren't we? I don't know why you're asking that question, mate. The village centre will comprise at least six large buildings to begin with. We can't fit any more than that here. So there will be other buildings away from the square. In particular, more extensive structures. I'm glad to hear it. I never expected you'd find so much space here in the middle of the woods. The building work we're about to engage in is only the first part of my plan. Later, we'll clear more forests for agricultural land and build more farmhouses. But, for now, we'll have to focus on more sensible goals. As you wish, my lord.
But rebuilding a whole village must cost the king's ransom, though. It's true it won't come cheap. Before the tradesmen settle here and start producing and trading, it will be necessary to invest a certain amount of capital. A certain amount? How much, exactly? I wouldn't venture to state a precise amount at this point, but I expect it will come to some thousands, even tens of thousands of Groschen. Well, that much? I hope you're good at haggling. We shall, of course, attempt to procure everything at the best possible price, but raising a settlement from the ashes you see around you is a costly business. Nevertheless, I can assure you, my lord, that if all goes well, the investment shall all come back to you with interest. I hope I shall live to enjoy it, Master Morris. We had a scout around. We conducted a basic survey, from which we can make a preliminary outline of the parcels. I already have in my head an initial plan of what can be built where. We should certainly have a church. I'd like to preserve the existing one. That should present no serious obstacles. The building is in much better condition than we anticipated. But extensive reconstruction will be required. That's to be expected. A village isn't a village without villagers. You'll need new subjects. Even preparing the ground for a building will need lots of labour. Where can we find so many people, sir? You sound sceptical, lad. But it's a good question. I've already given it some thought. I've agreed with Radzik and Hanish that we shall make an announcement in Rate to invite people to move here and help with the construction, which will bring them many benefits, but also obligations. In addition, I expect the prospects of a new home will appeal to your former Scalitz neighbors more than a makeshift camp by the castle walls. They'll be delighted, sir. A splendid solution, sir. I've also been concerned about how to bring settlers here. But now it seems there will be no shortage of new inhabitants after all. It seems things are finally looking up. We routed the bandits in battle, and Henry took care of the remnants. When can we get to work? Right away, as far as I'm concerned. All we need is people and the necessary funds. And we'll need someone to keep order, at least in the interim. True. I'll leave you some of my men. If I may... I would recommend quickly appointing a bailiff to take responsibility for the renewal of the village, its coffers and its citizens. True. Hmm. First things first. Since you understand these matters best, you shall take charge of the land parceling and building works. You'll be available to the bailiff, but answerable directly to me. I'd be honoured, sir. Thank you. And, as regards the office of bailiff, what about you, Henry? Yes, sir. You've proven yourself well. You've demonstrated that you're capable of solving problems, and you command the respect of your former... So sure. And you're also capable of maintaining law and order. I must concur. So, let us expedite matters. Henry, I hereby appoint you to the office of bailiff of the hamlet of Pribislavitz in my domain. My lord, it's a great honor. Thank you. You will oversee the initial renewal and administration of the village that will set the ground for further development. <laughs> but don't imagine it'll be a bed of roses, lad. Being bailiff doesn't mean you can do whatever you like. If you don't treat the settlers rightly, I'll soon find out and relieve you of your office. Besides, we can't spare a single Groschen from the Talmberg coffers now, with the province in chaos. So... You'll have to cover the cost for the building work from your own purse. Me? But Marius said it would cost a fortune. True. But from what I hear, you know how to get your hands on coin enough. So I expect you'll manage it just fine. <laughs> I'd like to know who's been spreading such gossip. And I am assigning you certain specific tasks. You must ensure the rebuilding of the church. That means complete reconstruction, wall paintings, and a new altar. See to it that in the future the village will be capable of supporting a certain number of people. For that, you will need to ensure the construction of essential artisans' buildings. And ultimately, the village must produce sufficient earnings to fund further expansion. 
But, sir, I've never done... I understand your concerns, but you'll be handsomely rewarded. I shall grant you the proceeds from the whole village for the first five years, and you have my permission to use the surrounding woods and land as you see fit. Well, that's, um... I mean... Are you sure I'm the right man for the job, sir? It's a lot of responsibility. As you said yourself, Henry, it's a great honour. Besides, you won't be alone in it. I'll assist you and supervise the construction work. Phew. All right, then. So, we're agreed. You'll give this document to the Rete Bailiff. He'll make the announcement to invite settlers, which should ensure enough people to begin work. At the same time... Your official appointment as bailiff will be announced. I don't know what to say, sir. I'm sure you won't disappoint me, Henry. And now I must get back to my duties at Townbrook. Send word when everything is prepared. Certainly, sir. Have a safe journey. Farewell, sir. Right, so let's start getting bold in. There's a good part in this game, this. One right about there. Can we talk? What now? Before we can start building as much as an outhouse, we'll have to get the whole area cleared, and we'll need lots of people to work the land and parcel it out. Right. So I suppose I'd better get to Ratai first and see to that announcement. Indeed. I'm sure the bailiff will be more than happy. It will get the refugees out of his hair, and the citizens will stop complaining. I'll stay here for now and start planning the building plots. As soon as the labourers arrive, I'll start allocating work to them. Right. I'll head out now then. Let's go Pebbles. We need to rest as well. Uh, excuse me. I can usually flash travel like that. I'm not that overloaded, man. Come on. Behave yourself. Oh, fuck off. Give them to dog, in fact. Look what I've got for you. You'll love this. Look what I've got for you. You'll love this.
God save you. I've got some goods here. Who's all right? Can we do something about the price? Well... Agree? We're getting there. Just drop the price a bit more. See now, I knew we'd come to an agreement. Let's have a word about the price. Hmm. Since it's you, that's better. Hi, that was...
save me. But... I have a document for you from Sir Divish. It concerns the renewal of Pribislavitz. The village you drove those bandits out of? The very same. So it's true then. Good. Good. Let me see that document then. Here it is. So what have we here? Hmm. 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 It says I should announce that anyone interested may move to Pribislavitz to live and work. And Sir Radzig and Sir Hanush also give their consent. Hmm. In that case, let's not waste any time. Come along with me. May the Lord watch over. Did he really just lock me in here? I'm gonna need to wait until somebody comes out. You, wake up. I can't believe you just did that to me. Wake up. that Henry of Scalitz is appointed to the administration of Pribislavitz and the office of bailiff therein, which office and privilege have been conferred upon him by Sir Divish for loyalty and services rendered. I would therefore recommend that our Scalitz friends consider this offer very seriously, as nothing better is likely to come your way anytime soon. Save you. What can I do for you? Take care.
Welcome back. What news from Ratai? Well, the bailiff read Sir Divish's decree, and now I'm officially bailiff of Pribislavitz. Then allow me to congratulate you. What will be your first step? First, I'll, um... I'll, uh... Hmm. Actually, I'm not quite sure. What would you recommend? As it happens, I already sought a few things in your absence. You might have noticed that the first people have come from Ratai. Yeah, I saw some heading here right away. So when they arrived, I was able to start clearing building plots with them. After they'd erected some temporary dwellings, that is. So we're ready to get things started? As long as you know what you want to build, I can show these new people what to do. We'll be building on the sites we've measured out. You can go and look them over first, if you like. I'll do that. I'll see what's going to be built where. Nevertheless, I doubt you'll be able to figure that out just from looking at the sites. Well, there's nothing here, so we'll have to build everything. Ale house, bakery, butchers, rat house. Did I mention ale house? Eventually. But be warned. To begin with, it's always best to start with facilities that will be producing construction materials for everything else. And since we'll mainly be using timber, it makes sense to set up a woodcutter's camp. All right. And then what? That depends. Every building has its use. You'll soon get the grasp of it. And it's all in the ledger. What about the workers' wages and buying materials for artisans? The money must be put in the trunk here. The expenditures for wages and materials will be taken from it. So you should keep it topped up to prevent delays. It reminds me, there's the matter of my own pay to be resolved. Ah, uh, yes, of course. Sir Divish guaranteed me a fixed income. What's more, this job is an exceptionally big one. I see. But how much are you thinking? I have a record of payment here somewhere. Hmm. Here it is. Let's say one quarter more than that. I can't afford that much. At least not now, right at the star. But I do need your help. How about this much? That's a fair offer. It seems we understand each other. I agree. Good. I'll put your wages in the trunk, too. Are you sure it's quite safe? Quite. Only you and I shall have a key and access to the trunk. Besides, we'll have guards on watch here. Ah, that's reassuring. That's about all to begin with. If you need any more details, I'll be happy to explain things to you. I want to build something. Two minutes in fact. Nah, we, need to, just now. we need to put the money in the trunk first. And then we'll start building. I want to build something. Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? Right, it's going to either be a butcher's or the baker's, but hold on. Tavern. Oh, we, don't we, want, here yet. we want stuff that we'll is going to make money. Down after a hard day's work. It's impossible. Check what you need in the ledger. 
Oh, you're joking me, mate. Are you I'm joking me, mate? Right, wait a minute, I'm gonna try one more thing first. Certainly. Hold on. Bakery. People have to eat, and bread is a must. So let's build a bakery. It's impossible. Right, I'll look at the ledger, mate. Okay, shut up. I'd rather not build it. I don't even know what I'm looking at, to be honest. I want to build something. Certainly, Master Bailiff. I'd like to build the rat house. It's impossible. Ray, right, fuck you. <laughs> Ray, right, let's try. A guard we need guards to protect the village and keep the peace, and we need to build them a guardhouse. It's impossible. Check what you need. That rickety old footbridge won't do. We need a proper bridge and a firm road. It's impossible. See if you tell me it's impossible one more time, mate. I'm gonna poke you right in the eyeball. You hear me? It's not impossible, nothing's impossible. You do as what I say, mate. I'm the bailiff here. We'll need woodcutters to ensure timber supplies. See, for don't you dare tell me. Hmm. Right, there right. we go. Hi. I, I, you do it? See, the fret uh, poking him in the eye there. That made him tell me. Made him say that there. He, knew, he didn't want to get poked in the eye. Right, let's go. Hey, come on then, on your feet. Waiting on you, mate. Should just rugby tackle on me. We're going to build here? Yes. Shall we get started? I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. Hmm. We've still got the means. We'll get stuck in then. I want to build something. Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? A 
People have to eat, and bread is a must. So let's build a bakery. Do not tell me it's impossible. It's impossible. Oh my god, mate. <sighs> um, but sure, let's try that again. It's impossible. I want the ones that are able to make money. The ones that, like, that's what you need in the game. Let's try a tavern it's again. It's impossible. Fuck off, man. You tell me it's impossible one more time, mate. Kid you not, try it. Trade is important, and we'll have a wagon bringing goods in, so we'll build a trader store. It's impossible. Mate, me and you're gonna fall out, pal. Like, I kid you not. Right, we try the guard's house again. The village and keep the peace, and we need to build them a guard house. It's impossible. Oh my god, me and you are really gonna fall out, pal. Stables. We need to get some stables built. It's impossible. Fuck off. Oh, what? That rickety old footbridge won't do. We need a proper bridge and a firm road. Hmm. All right, there we go. That should do it. We've got everything we need to start building. Come with me. I'll race you there. I'll race you there, mate. Last one, there's a smelly dick. So that down there, I'm sure it is there. Where is he? Where's the smelly dick? Even muck bet you, I see you, I see you. In fact, that's not him, I don't think. So that boy's walking the other way. Where is he? Oh, I see him. I see him. There he is. We're gonna build here? Right here. Ready to start? I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. Hmm. We've still got the means. We'll get stuck in then. I want to build something. Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? Let's build a butcher's shop. It's impossible. Well, people have to eat, and bread is a must. It's impossible. We'll need plenty of tools, and they'll need repairing too. So we have to have a blacksmith. It's impossible. I'd like to... Let's go to the site. I'll see to the building.
We're gonna build here? Right here. Ready to start? I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. All good. We can start construction. How you doing the Warriors mate? Thanks for stopping by brother. How was your weekend? I know I really can't wait until we get the trailer mate. Two more day eh, uh, first day it is, isn't it mate? I oh, mate, I cannot wait for it bro. Like, and see how in the Royal Edition you're able to build all with this here. They're gonna do something like that, but even better, if you get me, mate. I love this game. Hey, this game is just awesome. Good. I'm glad you're doing well, mate. I want to build something. Right. Te so don't tell me it's impossible it's again, mate. What's it to be? Nothing's impossible. We're Henry Scarlet's, mate. Right, I want a, f uh, a butcher's or a bakery. In fact, where's the tavern? We want the tavern, we want somewhere so everybody can get trade pissed. Oh, didn't we'll mean that. Wagon bringing goods in, so we'll build a trader store. Hmm. Right. Yeah, me too, mate. I hope that we get we some gameplay. Um, not just a trailer. I hope they show a trailer first. Then some gameplay straight after it. I do genuinely think the game is going to come out this year. I do think it's going to be a 20, uh, 2024 game. Because they have been working on the game for a little while now. I was going to start The Witcher. Uh, the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Tonight, but I know I'm quite close to finishing this game. So I just want to try and get all of this done. Then I can move on to the next game. But I will still be live streaming this on Thursday though. Just for the hype of uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. Do you think it's going to be 2025, mate? If it is, like, I, I could see that too, mate. I could see that happening, to be fair. Um, if it is a 2025 game, I think it might be early in the year, like, maybe from January to March maybe I don't think it's going to be like May or like November or onwards so if you get me bro I'm ready I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need hmm all good see the graphics in this in this game too sometimes it looks really good you know I, I don't know what engine they use for this game but I hope the next one is going to be an Unreal Engine. That'd be good. Because, like, the people that own the Unreal Engine 5, they let, like, lots of people, eh, lots of gaming developers, like eh, Remedy Entertainment, Damn. they used the Unreal Engine for Alan Wake 2. And it looked incredible, mate, eh, so... But this engine is quite good itself, to be fair. What's it to be? Aye, I agree with that too, mate. No game should release next, like close to Grand Theft Auto V. It won't do good in sales. But um, I'm hearing there's talks of Grand Theft Auto. Uh, sorry, Grand Theft Auto Six. There's talks of GTA Six meant to be twenty twenty six now. But I don't know if that's true. It's just rumours that are going around on Twitter right now. In fact, tavern. That's what we want. Well, we don't have a tavern here yet. People need to wash the dust down after a hard day's work. It's impossible. Check what you need in the... Right, wait there. How, how much money have we got left? I have got quite a good bit of money there. Because I, kn I knew this was going to happen in the game. So that's why I saved up all my all my money. Here. 
Yeah, me too, mate. See, I wouldn't mind if this game came out in 2025, to be honest, mate. Just give them enough time to work on it, you know, do their magic. But 2025 is going to be a great year for gamers. I'm thinking about buying the PlayStation 5 Pro. I've got the PS5 here right now, that's what I'm live streaming off. But the PS5 Pro is meant to be like a whole different console. So, and I'm hearing that Grand Theft Auto 6 is only going to be 30 frames per second on the normal PS5 and this generation of Xbox. But apparently it will run 60 frames per second. People were saying 120 frames per second as well. That it could be hitting that on the PS5 Pro. So, if that starts are right, I'm definitely thinking about buying one, mate. And they're meant to be coming out in the holidays, see, the Christmas holidays. Do not tell me it's impossible again, mate. I will freak out. It's impossible. He <laughs> dead, man. Jesus Christ, man. The guard house. We need guards to protect the village and keep the peace. And we need to build them a guard house. It's impossible. Mate, Check I could you not mean you're going to fall out. I, I've been looking at Ledger, mate, and I don't understand it. With all the woods around, we ought to keep bees here. There's always a demand for honey. Let's go to the site. I'll see you to the building. Right, I'll race you there. I'll race you there. Last one, there's a smelly dick. I think it's... Is it here? No, that's the woodcutters. Alright, I know that. I know that. We're going to build here? Right here. Ready to start? Let's go. I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. Hmm. All good. We can start construction. Aye, mate, though. No. Uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance is going to be one of the games that I'm looking forward to, obviously, GTA 6. But if Grand Theft Auto 6 isn't released next year, it's safe it gets pushed back to 2026. This Kingdom Come Deliverance 2 is going to be my most anticipated game, man. Eh? I'm really, really looking forward to seeing what they do with this. I want to build something. Certainly, Master. Right, well, we'll leave the church to the last. Right, bakery, come on, don't tell me it's impossible. So let's build a bakery. It's impossible. Fuck you, dickhead. Tavern. We don't have a tavern here yet. People need to wash the dust down after a hard day's work. It's impossible. <laughs> you really drive me insane with saying that, by the way. Eh. Uh, I'd like to extend my rat house. It's impossible. Check. Right, how much money have we got left? The last time I seen it was 10k. Look out. Whoop, jump. Eh, uh, it's there, in fact. I want to build something. Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? We need to get some stables built. It's impossible. Check what you need in the ledger. We'll need plenty of tools and they'll need repairing too. So we have to have a blacksmith. It's impossible. Right, see every time I don't understand this ledger thing. Hold on. Where is it? 
same here. Is this it, Dick? No. This? No. Where the hell is it again? There. Yeah, I seen that too, mate, that they got the triple the budget. Somebody else is backing them up right now, like, um, like giving them funds for the game to make it, like, better. I can't remember who it was, man. Dog, wished. But I, I cannot wait for it. F especially for this being their first ever game making it. They, they did really well, man. I want to build something. The, the second game is going to blow so, everybody away, hundred percent. What's it to be? Oh, was that who it was? Right. I didn't know. I wasn't too sure who it was. I did um, hear that they were getting backed up. But it's somebody else. But I, I couldn't remember who it was, man. But I, that's quality, man. The game's gonna be the game is honest. Are gonna be amazing. I reckon it's gonna smash this one out of the park. Like, see, they're gonna have obviously everything you can do in this game, but like ten times more. The graphics are gonna be a lot better too. I feel like the combat will be a lot more smoother as well. And you know how good this story is, too. So they're they're capable of making a great story again for it. Um, but me, honestly, I really cannot wait until we get the second game. And like I said, I wouldn't mind if it was a twenty twenty five game, but I kind of hope it's going to be a twenty twenty four game, but. I do see it, like, mostly coming out, like, the start, like you said, the start or the mid-2025. I think a lot of the games are going to try and stay clear of when Grand Theft Auto is going to come out. Because you know how it is with Rockstar, man, everybody. Everybody's waiting for Grand Theft Auto 6. Right, I don't know what I can buy, eh, I can build... We need to get some stables built. It's impossible. Check what you need in the ledger. Mate, I don't understand the fucking ledger, mate. I'm Scottish. Alright? No, we don't have a tavern here yet. People need I need to, to get more money too. After a hard day's work. It's impossible. I know, mate. I know. It's especially like, see, like I was saying, it was their first ever game to do, mate. Like, not many people really make a great game like that for their first ever game. You know, what I mean, this game got how many awards was it? A thirty. See, when you go into the like, I've got the Royal Edition version, eh? So it shows you on that, but I can't remember how many it is. Yeah, I don't think we can actually build anything at all now. It's impossible. I fucking hate this guy. I hate this guy, by the way, everybody. Uh, I don't think we can do any of that yet. Well, let's try let's it, in fact. In the church. I was going to try and leave that to it's last. Aye, I, I thought that. I thought you were going to say that there, War Chief. Right, we'll Forge. Plenty of tools and they'll need it's impossible. Oh, fuck off with that. Tell me that, man. It's fucking driving me insane. Hey, it's, that's impossible. That's impossible. That's fucking impossible. Protect the village and keep the peace. And we need to build them a guardhouse. It's impossible. Check what you need in the ledger. Aye, that's right, mate. I seen. I didn't know that the, one of the people worked on Fallout, but I knew one of the people that made this game worked on Mafia, and I'm sure he was. Was he the person, not a writer, like did the story for Mafia? I don't know if I'm right with that, but I knew. One of them were work, uh, working on one of the mafias, but I think it was like one of the first ones, eh? 
In fact, you tell me that was impossible already to me. Fucking, I'm gonna poke you right in the eye, pal. We need to get some stable. It's impossible. Right, I need to go and get some more money. Keep on telling me it's impossible. So, how am I doing with the village? Let's see. I can't wait until the new Mafia game comes out too. There's a Punisher far from having uh, being made right now as well. You'll need to get the tradesmen working better and creating space for more people. And see what I hope they do with that Punisher. I hope they bring in see the person that played in the Netflix TV show as the Punisher. He played Shane in The Walking Dead as well. I hope they bring him in for the computer game. He was like, he was brilliant. At, uh, so I actually so missed that there. How am I doing with the village? Let's see. Hold on, sorry. I talked right over mm. that. You're still far from having the income you need to make the village prosper. You'll need to get the tradesmen working better and creating space for more people. The church is still in ruins. Doesn't create a good impression. We're on the right track, but we haven't reached the end yet. All right, I'll get stuck in. Aye, that was him, mate. I don't know why they cancelled the TV, uh, the Netflix show, because that was brilliant, man. Like, he was made for that role, 100%. Right, we need to get more money, so let's go to Scarlet's. He's bashing a few heads over here. Right, where are y'all? Who's wanting their head cracked open? Where are you? There they are. I know it's an ambush hen. Right, one of them I've got a mutt too. Come on then, bring it on. Sit yourself down, soldier. Oh, you think you've got moves? Come fucking down, mate. What the fuck is going on here? I can't see. Nah, nah, hold on a minute. Hold on a fucking minute. Jesus Christ, I'm getting my ass kicked here. What? That's the first time that's ever happened to me since. Well, it's the first time that's happened to me since I actually started the game. I feel quite embarrassed right now. And they weren't... They weren't like humans or bandits, they were just normal people. They bullied me there. Same with me, the Warriors, mate. I say this all the time. This game is a lot better than Skyrim. 100% that. I can't believe they bullied me like that. That's the first time that's happened since I first started the game, man. Let's just pretend that didn't happen, everybody. Can we all agree on that, please? <laughs> no, but um, I agree with you there, mate. This game beats Skyrim hands down. But I'm more... Right, we're doing it this time. Oh, I'm ready for you all. I'm putting poison on my... On my... Uh, Mace as well. Are you with me, Mutt? That's humans there, I think. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, you motherfucker. Right, one down. Where's the others? Come on then. Hey, there was a sword there too. Where is it? Yeah. Oh, that was a herb, I think, in fact. Where was his sword? Yeah, I thought there was more than one there. He must have run away. Maybe we'll take the lot. I know, I know mate, 
with it having a big budget, mate, I th like the map in this game is quite big as it is, but it's going to be 10 times bigger than this. And see if it's like only next gen game, like a next gen game, PS5 and Xbox Series X and S. I feel like that they'll be able to do to, like a lot more than what they could in the PS for uh, the old generation. Uh, you want to fight, mate? Hey, you bastards! Who are you calling Fucking a bastard? Come on then! To heal, mate. Come on then, horse. Right, see, this is what. Get the dog. Spot a kick. Right, one down. Fucking get off me, you prick. I can't fucking move. Sit yourself down, soldier. You get away too. I'm over here. And see, this is what annoys me too, mate. See when you get... Like, you can't turn and lock on. You're always just locked on to one person, so they all try and surround you. And then when you try and go left to try and lock on to the other person on the left of you or the right of you, it doesn't work. And that's one of the biggest frustrations I have with this game. Like, trying to fight more than, like, two or three people. It's just solid. I know, see, that's what I want with the game as well. Uh, to be, have more battles, like, big battles. Remember when you took back this place? And that was amazing, that mission, I loved that. But it was because you, you had your army with you. And there's that place up here. I'm assuming that you've completed the game, mate, eh? So, see that place when you're here? If you remember that mission. I feel like you and the army storm that place as well. I've still not totally done it yet. I, I backtracked a little bit. I did actually do that and then I, I noticed that they take my stuff off me, so all the money that I've saved up, I couldn't get it back. And I needed it to build up here again. So um, I backtracked a little bit again. So I could do this mission. And have it all built. And then when I'm going to go into that place. I'm only going to use. Like armour that isn't the best. So it doesn't like. The stuff that gets took off me. I'm not that too bothered about. Right let's just deal with these bandits. Here, fuck the the ones that try and jump you, ambush you. Right, bandits, where are y'all? I'm coming for your soul. Put a uh, poison on my blade, on my mace. I thought they'd just respawn here. The bandits. But I, I hope the, the combat's a lot smoother. It's one of the biggest things that I've got that I want for the second game. Like, easier to lock on to different people. I want the combat to roughly stay the same, but just improved a little bit more. Because you, you'll know yourself, sometimes it can feel a bit clunky. I thought... Ah, oh, there is one there. Where are you? I heard you. To me, to me, I'll take it all, thank you very much. Spot a kick at Open Henry. And do you know, i seen on Twitter as well, the person that plays Henry in this, as um, he was up 
at Warhorse Studios recently and um, they took a picture together so I do feel like he might be he would, might have been doing some lines see I can't lock onto this guy Right, lock onto the other guy. There we go. Other guy. I can't fucking swing it. Right, one down. Nice one, dog. You just saved my ass there, man. Right, drop him. Yeah, me too, mate. I want the, uh, the combat to be upgraded a little, a little bit. It's mostly just trying to lock onto the different enemies. Because I feel like that can be a bit of a prick sometimes. Right, hold on. Try and move most of the heavy stuff to the horse. Fuck it. Just move everything. That's it. Fuck it. It'll do. We're gonna need to walk back, by the way, everybody, too, which is quite annoying, but you'll know yourself. The warrior mate, the warriors mate, uh, how much money you need and what you need to do to get the money. Sometimes it can be a bit annoying, but you need to do it, you know that. Like, there's been so many times where I've actually been here just raiding and getting like all the bandits around here and need needing to walk all the way back to the miller because he's the guy that has the most money. For me, that's the person I've always went back and sold, like, all my goods to. So, like, uh, with you not being able to get on pebbles, I've still got pebble, pebbles, mate, because I've tried to keep all my money for uh, building the town up. Um, so, I there's a good few times where I've needed to walk all the way from Skelets all the way back to the miller uh, next to Rattire. Or whatever it's called. Right, that's good. Anybody else here though? Right, I don't know if there's any more bandits around here. Do you mean the village in uh, up here? Um, where's the wee? See the place where you're bu you're building up here. It was that the, the village you're talking about, mate? I know you can make money off that. Um, but I am just in the middle way trying to build it all up now, mate. We'll get there, though, bro. I cannot wait for the second game, though. It's going to be so good. Right, I don't know if there is any more. Ah, yeah, 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 that's it, bro. Um, I am just in the middle way, trying to build it all just now. But 
I'll get there, bro. So did you do much over the weekend, mate? Thank you everybody for being here too, I really appreciate you all. This might actually be a boring live stream this by the way, because I'm just trying to build my town up. So I need to get all the money I can, and Pebbles ain't gonna let me on. Nope, guess that. So I feel like I might, I'm gonna need to walk back with all this stuff. Which is quite annoying, but needs must. I don't know if there's any other bandits here. I think we took all of them out. Wrong button, I keep doing that instead of going to the map. Right, let's just try up here quickly then now, in fact. Is it in here? Yeah, I forgot that you can do that too, mate. I need to do that mission for one of the millers. You need to sneak into one of the towns in satire, or whatever it's called. I can, I can hardly speak fucking English myself, never mind another language. Here, in fact, right here. Uh, I need to break into the shop at night and steal this for the miller guy. Like, why I like this game so much too though, it's just because it's really, it's realistic, it's really realistic. Where like, uh, I did enjoy Skyrim and that, but I'm not into all that magic stuff. Or like dragons and stuff like that too. It took me a while to actually sit down and watch Game of Thrones. I think it was like season 5 at the time I sat down and actually watched all of Game of Thrones. But it was just, that's what put me off, see the, like the dragons and stuff like that. I thought it was like dragons, magic, kind of basically, basically like Skyrim. But I ended up sitting down and watching it one day and I loved it. But I'm more into stuff being like medieval stuff being proper realistic instead of all that magic crap. Right, I don't know if you're, we're able to get up and out of this way. Better get my torch out in a second, because it's going to get dark real soon. Yeah, don't I? we can get out this way, in fact. Right, I don't know if we have actually killed all of the bandits, but... Do you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna actually just f go back. Right, I'm sure there is somebody here we can... No. Is it here? Yeah. Let's see if he's gonna buy anything off us. I did have Discord, mate, but um, I never had it hooked up to my... I had it like the app on my phone, then I ended up deleting the app because I was going to put it on my uh, PC and then I forgot the password for it. I'm a dumbass that way. I should write down my passwords. Um, but I'm going to make a new Discord up again, mate. Um, I'm, I'll do that tomorrow, in fact, as well. The, the Warriors, mate, do you play Call of Duty or Fortnite or stuff like that, mate? I play, I like to play games like that, uh, like I do lots of different kinds of games here um, but I mainly try and focus on single player games, especially through the week, like Monday to Friday then at weekends I do usually try and do like a one live stream of a single player game and then Warzone at night or Fortnite at night I usually only play Fortnite though when two of my friends are on to UFC fighters. Um, I get games with Johnny Walker, the Brazilian light heavyweight fighter in the UFC, and his brother Walter Walker, who is a heavyweight in the UFC, mate. So I only really play Fortnite when they're on, but I play a lot of Warzone, especially right now. I've been really enjoying Warzone, but like. 
my content doesn't do really that good when a, a live stream was on, but I just do it for my own fun, if you get me. Um, because the people that watched my channel were mainly into like Red Dead Redemption, Kingdom Come Deliverance, um, just single player games really, mate. But if you do play Warzone, man, I'll get you on one night. I'll, I'll do that. I'll look him up, mate. On is it YouTube? He's on, yeah. This person. Digital dreams. I'll, I'll definitely check him up. Check up that channel, mate. Is this all he does? Like just proper into Kingdom Come Deliverance. It is such a good game though this, eh? There's lots of people that haven't played this still too, man, and it amazes me because this, Well, I do understand because, like, God of War Ragnarok... Eh, sorry. God of War 28, 2018's version came out at the same time as this. And so did Red Dead Redemption 2. But... This game, like I said, this game got lots of awards too, so... Obviously, a lot of people do know about it, but... I... There's some out there that still haven't played this game and it shocks me, man. Ah, right, nice one, mate. Um, I've got the PC there and I've been wanting to buy this game on the PC because you, I think you, it was you who told me about the the graphics, the Ultra, gra uh, playing it on like the Ultra graphics or whatever it's called. I'm a caveman, mate. See, when it comes to technology, right, we might get jumped here. Um, you're a fucking rat. Get my fucking sword out. I knew I was going to get jumped there. There's a guy behind me too, man. Sit down, soldier. Right, that's fucking annoying me, man. Oh. I'll definitely buy it on the Steam, mate. Because it is really cheap right now, isn't it? Um, I'll definitely buy it, but like I said, I'm a proper caveman, see when it comes to technology, oh no, I'm back here again, no way, do you know what, fuck it, I know what I'm doing, I'm just going to go down here and go absolutely wild on this town right here, try and just st steal all the, the guard stuff and then I'll sell it at the miller, that's what I'm going to do. I cannot believe that just happened there. Where's a the horse? Where are you? There you are. I cannot believe that just happened, man. Right, let's just go here and go crazy on everybody. I'll 100% give it a wee watch, mate. See, after this live stream, I'll definitely check it up on it, mate. Because I'm interested in mods myself, eh? Um, I just don't know how to do them. But, like, I... I um, see, me, I'm, I love Resident Evil, right? And there's this new mod. I talked to this uh, YouTuber. All right, I'm going to do this here. I talked to this YouTuber who's a big Resident Evil uh, person 
and he's got a channel called Residents of Evil. His name's JJ. And uh, there's a new mod for uh, Resident Evil 2 Remake, where it's like fixed camera angle. Like the old games, and I love them, that man, eh? I love the fixed camera angles. Uh, yeah, so I want to buy Resident Evil 2 Remake on the PC and then try and figure out how you get that mod. I'll need to sit down and watch a video on how to actually do all with the mod and stuff. Because I'm proper clueless mate when it comes to that stuff. Right wait there, you've got something there I want. Move! There we go. Right, where's the horse? Right, so we were heading here. Or did you try and send a link into chat and then YouTube removed it? I didn't know that they did that mate eh? Um, I'll definitely check that channel though. See after this, after this live stream I'll 100% check that. Um, because I, I'm interested in the mods. And I love Kingdom Come, you know what I mean? So I mate. 100% will check on it. Right, you, in fact. I'm just gonna kill everybody here. I'm gonna save it first, in fact. Have I got one of these snaps? Yes, I No, I don't. I thought I did have. Fuck it. Charles Oliveira. Don't. You'll slaughter no update. If I no put, I thought I put. I thought I put poison on my weapon. Right, one at a time, one at a fucking time. Fuck off man. Oh my god man. I'm getting my ass kicked in this live stream. I've not had my ass kicked like that for a long time man. Nice one mate, I'm definitely in oh, mate, I cannot believe this is happening to me. Stressed. Um I'll definitely 100% have a wee look mate because I'm definitely going to buy it on the, PS, uh, the PC and um, if, does he talk you through how to do the mod on his YouTube channel? Ah oh, fuck, right and uh, I know what I'm gonna do. I'll just draw them out one by one. Right. I'll watch a YouTube channel. Uh, I'll watch something on how to do the mods as well, mate. Because, I, like I said, I'm really interested in doing that and live streaming it. Like, see, with uh, Ultra Graphics. Because how stunning would that be, mate? This game I'm talking about. With real life graphics, mate. I can't actually wait until I look up that, mate. Look up that video. This game will be stunning, man. 
And just imagine what Kingdom Come 2 is going to look like and on the PC with the graphic mods. It's going to be insane, mate. It's just, well, you said that that other mod is like just looking like in real life, basically. Looks like real life. So imagine what it's going to be like with the mod in Kingdom Come 2's graphics. It's going to be insane, mate. Ah, nice one, mate. I can't wait, mate, honestly. It's going to be so good. Right, we need to bring some of the guards down this way. Sleep. To me, take your soul while we're there. Right, let's bring some of these guys down the way. Put some more poison on my my mace. Could actually just poison this town too, in fact. Who's, who's fucking hit me? You bastard. Trying to turn around, man. Spot a kick. What are you laughing at, mate? You're down. You're down and out. Don't hit my dog. Dog, get him. Sit yourself down, soldier. This is my town. Oh, 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 okay, okay. I see y'all. No, you're in the wrong place at the wrong time, pal. You don't want this smoke. Right, come down this way. Oh, shit, somebody at bind. Is that, no? Aye, aye, that's somebody there. Spot a kick. Right, there's a an arrow guy there as well. This is my town. Just taking that town over this time, like. Oh 
hold on, I'll get to chat in a second, everybody. Is he taking a piss? Don't move a finger. Get him. Right to me. I'll take everything here. I think that's somebody running to me there. Maybe not. Right, get the uh, torch out. I'll definitely, 100%, be buying this on the PC, man. I'd, I've always wanted to try mouse and keyboard on this too, because I feel like it'd be a lot better than controller, especially with combat. I tried to hook up the... See, when I first went to go and live stream this game, like for the first time, I did try and hook up my mouse and keyboard to it, because I play... Call of Duty with mouse and keyboard. So uh, I I tried to do it and it didn't work though. But I it'd be quite cool to try it out. I'd get off that sword. I'll take that too. Right, any other guards here wanting some smoke? Hey, armor. I haven't got that good much good stuff to be honest. We might need to go to the band camp, uh, bandit camps. I feel like we might need to do that. We can't carry any more. Let's try and loot in shops and stuff like that too. Now that we've got rid of all the guards. Ah, fuck off. I see this too, I feel like it would be a lot better on mouse and keyboard. Hey, so what one is it? It's not that one then. Is it this or is it that? Right, so it must be this one. Hey, don't you worry about it. Don't you worry about it, mate. You're under arrest for breaking the law. Come, dog. Don't you hit my dog. Don't you hit my dog. Dafty hitting my dog. It's just going a mass murder. I'm sorry, pal, but you're getting it too. Help! Over here! Everybody's getting in this town. We need the money. Thought we would have got the key from them there, but obviously not. I don't know what one it is. If it's the top one. There we go. Just take everything we can. We need the money.
Eh, there is. My God, guard, quick! There's a corpse there. Over there, my God, there's a corpse. Sorry, bring them, bring them. I need their stuff. You're just taking everybody out. Like we're taking no prisoners. I can't run really, but let's check in here, see if there's any valuable stuff in here we can take. Don't you worry about it. Don't worry about it, boys. You're all right. I'll put you a bit. I'll put you to bed. Nobody else here. No, it's fine. Come on. Come on. Somebody's just walked in here. Nothing. Don't worry about it. Can we not pick them up? No. What? I'm sorry, but you had to go. You seen too much. She's seen too much, everybody. I can't find the be arrow thing. Where is it? I see it now. Is that a guard? No. In fact, we've just been in there, I'm sure. I should have stealth killed them there.
Yeah, so we've been in there. It's this one we need to be in now. We've just went rogue on everybody in this village. Get him! Is that something coming out? No. Okay, so, yeah. Sounded like a zombie there.
there. Answer me. In God's okay. name. Oh.
skull above. He's carrying a... Jesus! Oh!
Watch it. To heal, Mutt.
Hey, God be with you. I've got some goods here who's... All right, God be with you. Got some goods. All right, God be with you.
I'd like to discuss the price. Well... What about this? That's better. Drop it a bit more and we'll call... Finally. Here you're able to open. Certainly. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll... Isn't that quite a lot? Satisfied? You're a right pinch purse. You're flaying me here. Well, uh, agree. Oh, Henry. I've got all right. Damn it! Alarm! My God! Here! Don't let him get away! Ah! Christ!
Devil. Help! Guard, quick! There's a corpse there. For God's sake! There! Over there! Oh, yeah. Oh. 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 Oh.